Hey guys, it's Helen. If you follow my work uh, the past few years, you've seen that I race against undefeated pro boxer Guido Vianello. I swam with Cynthia Calvillo. I swam with Lauren Murphy. And I took some time off to focus on training because I'll be honest with you, it's been really hard and just trying to get back into swim shape. But now I'm back and today I'll be swimming with the Cardio King, Marab Dvalishvili, number one ranked UFC bantamweight, so stay tuned. Five, four, three, two, one, let's go. <laughs> it's cold. Two breath work. Katie Miller breath work. So, okay. uh, so what we do? So we're going out, we're going to jump, and then we are going under the water. We have to make holy shit, we get up the tail. <laughs> Nice. Wow. Wow. How do you feel? It's, I like challenges. This is, that was good. That was good. Yeah, that's why I think right. you you were really close to me. I really? think you almost beat me. Wow, no, no, you, you really have a speed. So Marad, yes. We just swam. Yes. You are the machine. You guys, <laughs> I witnessed firsthand his cardio. Incredible. Ah, I'm the okay. best. I'm okay. I'm machine, but not swimming machine. You are swimming machine. <laughs> no, yeah. you, you are amazing. Thank you. And you could hold your breath so long. What's the longest you can ever hold your breath? Uh, actually, I don't know. I learned swimming in the river in my village. And when I was a kid, I was always, always challenged my friends. And I don't really remember, but uh, you know, I, this is good for cardio. Yeah. Good for MMA. You know, I always. So I always do my best. I don't, I'm not counting, you know? Yeah. I just do my best all the time. That's, that's yeah. my secret. Yeah, well, your secret is you're doing amazing. You're the number one ranked UFC bantamweight. So I have to ask you, though, that yeah. video, the famous video of you swimming in that hotel pool. Right. Were you challenged to do that, or you just felt like doing it for fun? Just doing it. Like, you know, I was, it was like a pool party or something. Uh-huh. And then... Um, and then I was, yeah, me and my friend was hanging out there, and then, and then just idea came, and oh, I, I said, <laughs> I wanna, yeah, I wanna challenge to see if I can make to end, but it was actually long, long pool, I jump and I made it. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I was surprised you didn't uh, swim into any tampons or diapers. Yeah. Those, those pools are not that clean. Oh. <laughs> you're right, you're right. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, yeah people are getting drunk and going to this pool. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah, that's... Yeah, for sure. But you did great. Um, look, today I saw Sean O'Malley. He tweeted. Marat, he spelled your name on though. Yeah, I know, but I don't care. He finally answered seven years later. You know, I was calling him seven years, not seven years. The only one guy who I want to fight with, that's Sean O'Malley. And uh, uh, I guess it's, it's this time is better. I think this is the best time because he's champion now. Yeah. He's he's even bigger star he's ever been. And uh, now I, I will finally get what I deserve, fight for the belt. And I'm not only going to fight, I'm just going to win. I believe this. And actually, like, I tell Sean, <laughs> I'm gonna knock him out. <laughs>
Yeah. Nice. And I know the fans are excited for that, for you to fight them. Do you think, ideally for you, I mean, you're Mexican Marab. Yeah. So you also told the Schmo you'd love to fight him at the Sphere? Uh, I would love to, and my Mexican people would love <laughs> to do me fight him at the Sphere. And uh, that would be great. That would be, that would be his story. You know? And uh, I think, yeah, I think we both deserve to fight there. Because I gotta represent my Mexican people. Yeah. Did he ever DM you his address? You're wanting his address. I did text him to give. He never texts me address. Yeah, because yeah, you bought him flowers. Yeah, because wow. I was here. Because Major, he he beat the beat the shit out of the cheater and he O'Malley break his hand, break his leg. He was he break his liver. You know what I'm saying? He break yeah. everything. Yeah. What kind of win is this? Like you pro, bro. You know, usually yeah. after my fight, I mean, I, I mean, <laughs> I don't know, but yeah, I, I, every time I win my fight, or after I, I don't have any injuries. I don't know. But I don't know. It's, I'm, okay, I don't want to talk about. I don't want to shit about. <laughs> I don't want to talk about shit about him. I don't know. <laughs> but but Bert, you do have to tell him how to pronounce your name. Of course, come on, yeah, like. Uh, shame on him, like Marab. He said Marab. Marab. Yeah, Marab. Yeah, something. Like, yeah. I know. I have to. I have to teach them English. Even I need to. <laughs> yeah, you, you're yeah. Professor Marab. Yes. yes, yes. Professor Marab, cardio yeah. king Marab, swimmer Marab. You swim in ice too. You jump yeah. in ice. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> it's 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 island. Uh, it's I don't know. You know. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not. I'm trying to be pro like you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to be like you. You're doing amazing. How's uh, how's Aljo? Did you guys train today? Uh, uh, are we gonna training now? After this, I'm or gonna go training in the garage with Aljo. Wow. Yeah, yeah. So did you train earlier too? Uh, I did, but I like training this morning. Like 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 touchy sparring. Uh huh. Syndicate MMA. And uh, uh, yeah, now we're gonna go training one more, and uh, we have a dinner to together tonight. Me, Aldo, and my team, our teammate is fighting tomorrow. Yeah. And then uh, our friend made wait this morning, and now we will have a dinner night time. What kind of dinner do you guys eat before fighting? It's like a either steakhouse or something like this, like. Oh, lots of food. Lots of food, yeah. yeah. But how how do you like your steak cooked? Medium. Okay, Just good medium. answer. You yeah. you don't like well done, right? Listen, I like to eat. <laughs> I can eat everything. I, yeah. I, I I I never say no to food, or I'm not like I'm not I'm not picky, you know. Yeah. But I like medium, like I don't know, medium well. Yeah. What's yeah. your favorite food? Mm. I like um, mac and cheese. Ooh, yeah, yeah I like steak. Good. I like steak. I like uh, Georgian food, hachapuri. I like Georgian food, hinkali. I mean, I, I, I love to eat, and you know, I love I love Mexican food. <laughs> yeah, you know, tacos. You know? yeah. yeah, I just like to eat. You know, I like to. I like training and eat because this way, yeah. When I train hard, I can eat all, and I can eat all day. Yeah. Well, you deserve to eat all the food. Yes. But your last fight, really impressive win over Henry Cejudo. What do you mean? Were you surprised that Henry retired again and then decided to come back? And it looks like he wants Brandon Moreno. Oh uh, yeah, and now he's calling Chito Vera. I wasn't surprised because. We are fighters. We love what we do. Yeah. And uh, we not, you know, uh, we not fighting uh, money or something. This is something that what we love. Yeah. yeah we are passionate with, with this. You know, I want to fighting all my life. I cannot imagine that me myself retire even if I win the belt. Yeah. But I never want to retire. I want to keep fighting, challenge myself, yeah. challenge the opponents. You know, like, I and mean, then this is just life, right? You want to be. When you challenge yourself, you're working hard, you have a discipline, that's life, when life is good. And if you just, 
retired, sitting home and yeah, doing bullshit. <laughs> it's, like, it's like interesting life, you know? Yeah. You know, that's, you know, like he's a hard worker guy. He's all his life, he's, he's, he was doing competition training and now it's very hard to retire. Yeah. Um, I wasn't surprised. I wish he's all that good. You know, he's, Henry, I, I have so much respect for Henry. You know, he's hard worker, good family, but now he has two kids. Mm -hmm. You know, of course I, I respect him that. You know, he likes to joke, make fun of, fun of fighters. I don't think he should do that. <laughs> because I don't know why he called me a rat. And oh, he, yeah. yeah. Like, come on, bro. Yeah, but but I, I thought you taught him how to pronounce your name, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I did, I did, I did. Yeah, yeah, I, I like him, I like him. And uh, yeah. after Josie Aldo, I like Henry most, you know, I respect him. Yeah. So I know you're training three times today because I appreciate you swimming with me. Oh, this is, this is fun. This is yeah. good cardio uh, training. And uh, pool is nice and warm. Oh, yeah. yeah. It, it feels like a hot tub here. Yeah, nice. Don't worry, it's not my pee. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just no, I'm yeah, serious. Yeah. It's not. But yeah. uh, so when you're not training, though, do what do you like to do for fun? I like uh, same. I like activity. Like maybe I like uh, hiking. I like um, you know, hang out with my friends. Uh, so maybe play some game like ping pong or oh, okay yeah you know, like not you, video games but no games. no no I don't okay like, no I'm, I don't play <laughs> any video games but this is bullshit you know <laughs> and um, and I like to invite my friends I like to have a barbecue in my house now you know, I used to cook like steaks and stuff but yeah. it's too hard and now I'm just ordering sometimes uh, ordering food in Mexican restaurant sometimes ordering food in Italian restaurant sometimes. Uh -huh. Some um, a Hawaiian barbecue place, you know. Yeah. And then like, just I like to have a good time with my friends because life is short, and I like I like I like I love to spend time with my friends and enjoy enjoy yeah. every every moment. And uh, and I have so much to do now, you know. Like, uh, uh, you know, I have so many good friends. Um, I have so many things going on social media. I like to listen podcasts. I like to listen. Like you guys, interviews, you know, so because yeah. I always, I like to, uh, yeah, I like to keep up with MMA, like what these guys, I watch, I like to watch interviews, you know, like yeah. MMA, MMA, but I don't watch any other sports, I only watch MMA. Best sport ever. Yeah, best sport ever, and there is always something going, always some little drama, good drama, oh. <laughs> you know, and uh, yeah, life is good, you know, I mean, I have, I do. So and then I have to travel like UFC is going on almost every week, and uh, yeah, you've been at like all the pay per views, right? Oh uh, yeah, yeah, most. <laughs> but you know what I noticed? Every time they announce you and show you on screen, yeah. the fans they love you. Oh, yeah. You are like so nice. the fan favorite. I mean, yeah, I, I want to tell all my friends around the world, thank you so much, really, it's a big motivation for sure. And wherever I go, everybody telling me, oh, let's go fight for the bed, beat this O'Malley, you know. But yeah. now it's finally, it's official, I win my fight, O'Malley win this yeah. his fight, he's champion, I'm number one, and uh, now it's it's time. Everybody, like, you know, even Dana, mm -hmm. even Sean, even... Match maker Sean Shelby, you know, of course, people always wanted to see this fight. But yeah. Like now, everybody, we are all same page, you know? Yeah. We, we all want, and it's gonna happen, hopefully, it's in uh, UFC Noche, in Mexico, uh, Mexico's uh, Independence Day. The atmosphere. Atmosphere, yeah, hopefully that day. And yeah, it's, I'm excited, you know? It's almost, I don't believe, because I want to fight this fight seven years it's finally happening <laughs> I know, finally it's, it's, yeah but it's, it's very hard to believe because it, i was i wanted this for so long yeah and then i will believe when i will just will be seen oh, in, in, in the cage with yeah me. that's why i will believe because before that it's i don't, I don't know it's really it's a dream just for fighting crazy but at least now seven years later it will be for the title yeah. 
Lastly, I won't make you swim anymore. We, I feel like we swam a mile already. No, for the fans who love you and can't wait to watch you fight for the title, fight Sean O'Malley, what would you like to let them know, Murad? Uh, this is, first of all, thank you guys, everybody, because um, yeah, really, really, I, I feel very big support and love from you guys. And um, this is going to be a great fight. And uh, it's interesting fight because Shaika versus Draftler. And let's see if, if if I can knock him out. Let's see. And I'm gonna I'm gonna challenge myself. I'm gonna I'm looking forward to knock him out because I'm gonna beat him. He's, he's in his game. So let's see. But anyways, it's gonna be a good fight. And um, it's, uh, it's it's nothing personal. It's a big fight. It's a big challenge. And uh, I, I don't look him as a easy opponent. It's gonna be tough matchup. But that's what it's all about, right? It's uh, the best, worst yeah. best. Now we are the two best guys in division. He's champion, I'm number one. And let's let's make this fight happen. And uh, let's see. We all have to enjoy. I'm gonna enjoy. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know about if all Mali will enjoy, but you guys will be enjoy. You guys will have a good time. So let's go, guys. The machine! The machine! Yeah! The swimming is good cardio. I respect you guys, you guys swimmers. Really, really, they have really good cardio. So it's honor for me to swim with you.